Hi friends, Zoe here, and today I want to share with you a poem that was actually recommended to me by one of our friends here on the channel, Rockin' Robin. So thank you Robin for recommending that I read this poem because it truly struck a chord with me and I just really think that this poem deserves its own video and its own little conversation going on down in the comments down there, so I really encourage you guys to participate. So let's get started. So I'm going to start off by reading you guys this poem and I'm going to share a few of my thoughts and then I really truly do want you to participate and let me know your thoughts on this poem as well or if you've heard of it and what your initial thoughts were because I'd love to hear from you and get to know you a little better as well. So this poem is called Anyway by Mother Teresa. People are often unreasonable, illogical, and self-centered. Forgive them anyway. If you are kind, people may accuse you of selfish ulterior motives be kind anyway. If you are successful, you will win some false friends and some true enemies. Succeed anyway. If you are honest and frank, people may cheat you. Be honest and frank anyway. What you spend years building, someone could destroy overnight. Build anyway. If you find serenity and happiness, they may be jealous. Be happy anyway. The good you do today, people will often forget tomorrow do good anyway. Give the world the best you have, and it may never be enough. Give the world the best you've got anyway. You see, in the final analysis, it's between you and your God. It was never between you and them anyway. So thank you, Robin. I absolutely love this poem, and it definitely brought about a lot of thoughts for me about living your truest and most authentic life. And I'm going to leave the poem written out in the description box below and I encourage you to read it over to yourself and really think about it. Because you only have one life in this lifetime and it's a short life. And before you know it, you know, one day you're 20 and then you're going to be 40 and then you're going to be 60 and then life's just going to start unraveling faster and faster. And I just really hope that each and every single one of you are striving every single day to live your most truest and authentic life. If you have passions, if there are things you want to pursue, I just really hope that you're going to pursue them. Like it says in the poem, it is never between you and them anyway. I think a lot of us struggle with worrying about what other people think, and I'm definitely going to make a video all about that uh, with all of my advice on how to stop caring what other people think, because life is too short to care what others think of you. You really just need to do whatever you feel like doing, whatever you want to do, you need to pursue that. You need to forget about the, the thoughts and feelings of others because it's really just a pointless grasp that they have on your life. If there's something that you crave, if, there, if there's something that you want, then you really just owe it to yourself to go for it. You don't want to wake up one day, 20 years from now, wishing that you would have done something in your 20s that you didn't do. and. By you not pursuing the things that you want to do in your life, you're going to carry this around with you and it's going to cause you to resent things and possibly even people. The truth is, this life is about you and your soul and your mind and your body. We're all in this game called life and we all face demons and challenges, but we're all faced with different ones. So it's important that when you're faced with a challenge, you don't become bitter, you just push positivity and love on the situation and get yourself through. When you're faced with challenges, I know it can be easy to be discouraged, whatever they may be, but the truth is when you're faced with these challenges, all the universe wants from that is to help you grow from them. I also want to touch on the fact too, again, about your purpose and your passions. I hope that when you're so passionate about something and you feel like you really have a purpose in something, you're not discouraged by the voices of others to not pursue it. Whether this be you know, a business opportunity, just a personal endeavor, a trip, maybe it's a person that you really desire having a relationship with. I hope that you don't get caught up in the, the thoughts and feelings of others because you owe it to yourself to live your truest and happiest life without regrets. And I personally don't believe in regrets because I live my life and I do whatever I want however I want to do it. If I'm feeling something in the moment, like if I feel spontaneous and I want to, you know, go make plans and go have fun and I'll do it. And I build really awesome memories that way. Like this poem says, people may think all different types of things of you, but the truth is if you think really good about your yourself as a person, you're not going to care about the thoughts and feelings of others. So I really hope that you're taking the time every single day to build yourself up into a person that you really admire and the person that you really want to be. When you feel full as a person and you feel full of positivity and 
self-love. You're going to attract amazing people into your life, whether these be friends or partners. And just the more positivity you can exude, the happier your life will be and the more amazing things you're going to attract into your life. The universe loves you and it really wants the best for you. So learn from the challenges it hands you and try and become a better version of yourself every single day. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling about this poem, but I really truly want to know what your guys' thoughts are on it, and please participate in the comments and let me know below. And like I said, I just love getting to know you guys, so thank you so much. And if you like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe below, and I'll be seeing you again very soon. Bye!